Welcome back. Mac and I are going to be opening my Stitch Fix box for March, and this is going to be my 24th Stitch Fix box, so that is two full years um, of getting these boxes with breaks in between. And I did ask for something specific this time. I asked her for some high-waisted black jeans because who doesn't need those? And the only ones I have are jeans, or like blue jeans, so I need some black ones. So that is the only thing specifically that I asked her for. The rest of the stuff in this Stitch Fix box um, is definitely geared toward the warm weather coming in. All right, so let's get to it. If you guys don't know, Stitch Fix is a clothing subscription service, and you can get a box every month, whenever you want, every couple months. All kind of depends on what you're feeling and there is a $20 styling fee the $20 styling fee goes towards anything you actually keep in the box so that goes towards any of your purchases so it's not just $20 that you lose unless you don't like anything and you send the whole box back you got a thing about eating the boxes lately um, and then if you keep there's five items in every box it could be clothes shoes accessories earrings, purses, anything like that. So five items and if you keep all five then there's a 25% discount on top of the $20 that you get for the styling fee. So with all of that out of the way, let's go ahead and take a peek at what is in this box for March. With the box they send a little uh, card kind of telling you what's in each box and how to style the different outfits just to give you some inspiration because like me I'm not very good at that and then for anything that you don't like they give you a um, they give you a return so you can send that the first thing that I'm gonna pull out are these earrings and there will be a try on by the way so I will try all of this stuff on for you so I got a pack of earrings and they're all really cute. I especially like these bars. Um, if you haven't noticed, I wear like the same earrings all the time. So I'm really excited. These are really cute. There's five pairs and they are all gold and some of them have little like diamonds in them like flowers and round. Pretty much. That's it. And these are by Kivia. And that set of earrings, I actually have this out for you today. Okay, so the Kivia set of gold earrings are 36 So five pairs of earrings, $36. And then the second thing in my box, you guys probably remember from my other videos, that other off-the-sleeve top that I got, the black one. So this is another off-the-shoulder I love this print. It's really pretty. And it's got this embroidery. Can you see that? Like all all the way around. So on the sleeves and everything, it has this embroidery all the way around. And it's got fun, like, I guess that is leaves, yellows, and blues. It's very, like, very beachy. And it's very stretchy. And this is a size large. This is by Skies Are Blue. I think I have one or two other tops by them in my closet somewhere. So these, this is the large Skies Are Blue off the shoulder. And let's see, this is 54. So this shirt is 54. I think it's really cute. I'm excited to try this on for you. I have not tried any of this stuff on yet. So it'll be a first time for all of that. The third item in my box this month for March, like I said, this is all really spring, springy stuff. So the next thing is this, like, would you call it a tank top? I guess you would. It's very, very flowy in this almost gold yellow color. I don't think the video does a good job showing you mustard yellow. That's what I would call this. I would call this mustard yellow. It's got the big open arm slits. I'm kind of weird about showing my arms. And then down the front, it has that detail of like a seam. 
and these ties. I'm not sure how I feel about these ties. And this is made by Lemon Tart. I don't have anything by them in my closet. So this is a new one for me, but it has these ties. So I'm very interested to see how this fits. It's kind of, it's pretty long. So we'll just have to see. We'll have to see in the try on how that looks. That Lemon Tart, they call it mustard. So I was right. Okay, so the Lemon Tart tassel mustard size large that is 58 so that tops 58 now this next one I I don't know how I feel about this next one it's very pretty it's very bold I like the flowers I like the blue but like I, I it's just a lot it's got these balloon sleeves if I had a top, this must be in style because I had a top during my FabFitFun style box that I just opened last month that had these balloon sleeves and um, I wasn't a big fan of it. And the other thing about this top, it's got this keyhole right in the front. I don't know if you can, there you go, kind of see it like that. This top is completely see-through, like completely. When I'm looking through this at my phone right now, completely see-through so you have to wear something under it it's very flowy it also has this nice little stitching detail right there there you can kind of see it right there and that's on both sides of the front by the sleeves I don't know if I'm gonna like this but that's just very bold right on the front so let me know what you think about that that one who did I say that was by? Did I even say? That one is Collective Concepts, and I don't have anything by them either. And that's also a size large. So that is Collective Concepts Large. That's 68. For it being like an iffy top for me, I don't know if I'm going to spend the $68 on that. Just because... Like, I just, I just don't think I like it. I, I haven't tried it on, like I said, so we'll have to see. So the fifth and final item are the high-waisted black jeans. They're a little bit lighter than I was hoping they would be. I kind of wanted a really dark black, but these are really nice too. So there's no distressing on them at all. They have kind of the faded, I would almost call these gray, to be honest. Like, they look gray to me. They don't look black. But that must just be the distressing. So it's a single button and a zipper. So they call... This is cut from the cloth. I love cut from the cloth pants. Love them. I have a lot of pairs in my dresser over there. They, they last a long time. I have... I've got the thighs that rub... You guys all know what I mean. And I have rubbed my thighs through plenty of pairs of pants. But I feel like this brand lasts really long. I wear them all the time. So I'm excited to try these. Not quite what I was expecting when I requested black high-waisted jeans. But I'm sure they'll look great. So these are the cut from the cloth black. These are size 10 petites. I'm only 5'4", so they give me petite sizes. Um, and these are 88. So this is def this is the most expensive thing in my box. The grand total of the box today comes to $304. And then if you keep all five items, that is 76 off, so that's 228. And then you get your styling fee. So if I keep everything with the 25% discount and the styling fee, that comes out to a grand total of $208. Not bad. I really don't think I'm going to keep this whole box. I'm going to try these on and see how those look. Really, I'm Just from, if I were to go to a store and see this blue, this right here, I don't think I would ever pull this off and try it on. But that's the good thing about Stitch Fix. They get you out of your comfort zone and you try things on and you find you like things that you don't. Not sure how I feel about that. 
This is a very iffy box for me. For being box number 24, it's very iffy. And that, we'll have to see how I feel with my arms in this one. I would love to hear what you guys think about these items and kind of how they fit. And if you just want to talk, talk Stitch Fix or any other style box, I would be more than happy to with you. So definitely comment below. I'm doing the try on for you so you'll see how everything fits, at least my body type. I'm going to put the link for Stitch Fix under this video. You guys are more than welcome to go on and check it out. You'll get $25 off your first box um, if you use the link. And then be very specific with your stylist. Like, tell them exactly what you like and don't like. Because they obviously don't know you. And you can work with the same stylist every single time, or you can decide just anybody. So I've had the same stylist for a while, which is why I'm kind of surprised this, this box was iffy, but she's trying to get me out of my comfort zone, so I understand that. Um, I hope you guys have a really great week, and I will see you guys at my next video. Bye!